election race in Pueblo County has been left off hundreds of ballots by mistake. The Pueblo County clerk and recorder tells 13 investigates those ballots will now be voided. Investigative reporter Sean Rice is live at the Pueblo election building with what Pueblo voters need to know. Sean. Heather Mallory, 250 uniformed military members and overseas voters received a ballot without the county commissioner's race listed on it. The county clerk tells me this was simply an error that is now being fixed. And people need to have uh, trust in the election and, and when things pop up like this, it does does not help. Mike Schuster is a Democratic nominee for Pueblo County Commissioner. His wife expected to see his name when she received a primary ballot and attempted to vote for her husband. She got a ballot and when she was voting it, she, she noticed that the county commissioner race and my name was not on there. Pueblo County Clerk Gilbert Ortiz tells us the oversight was a quote error, saying the county system used to generate ballots did not include the commissioner's race. Ortiz says only 250 uniformed military members and overseas voters received the incorrect ballots. My wife's not an overseas voter. Uh, <laughs> I took her down there myself, so uh, no, I, I think maybe we ought to just check the whole thing and, and make sure everything's okay. To, so everybody has confidence in what's going to happen. Schuster tells 13 Investigates he is happy he caught the mistake to ensure every vote he receives is counted. People may not have questioned it at all if they went and got a ballot and they said, well, I don't live in this district or whatever, and they wouldn't, they wouldn't have the opportunity to vote. So it is important because, you know, to, I was lucky enough to come across this. The clerk tells 13 Investigates that new ballots will be reprinted and sent to each voter who had an inaccurate ballot. He says the corrected ballots will be mailed by the deadline. That deadline is a week from today. Reporting live in Pueblo, Sean Rice, 13 Investigates. All right, Sean, thank you.